Hello guys, it's Riker, man. Welcome back to another preview prediction video, man. So today we're going to be talking about Manchester United versus Liverpool. Um, this is the North West, North East or North West Derby, man. Um, uh, Manchester United versus Liverpool, man. This Derby go way, way back, man. So uh, one of the biggest rivalry in England and uh, in Europe, man. So um, two opposite, man. Liverpool is one of the best team right now in the world. United is not the one, it's one of the worst team right now out there, but you're still a big club. Um, yeah, how the time have changed, man. But I don't think it's going to last for a long time. I think eventually United is going to be back where it's supposed to be, and I think Liverpool eventually is going to fall off, man. I don't see they're gonna. I don't think they're gonna continue playing the way they're playing for for the next five years, man. I think eventually Liverpool are gonna go back to where they were, in my opinion. But it is what it is. You could you could correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, but yeah, because Klopp's not gonna be there forever. And uh, yeah, so um, this should be a very interesting game, man. United is struggling from, uh, yeah, they're missing a few players, man. De Gea is out of this game, Papa is out of this game, and I believe my boy Martial is back, man. I think one of the main reasons why United was struggling, and couldn't score goals, was because Martial was out. He was one of their top goal scorer, one of more, one of their most exciting players before he got hurt. And once he, once Matia went out, man, once he got hurt, the team just went downhill, man. So when he came back, I think they're gonna start winning games again. They're gonna have some more goals. They're gonna have some more threat, man. And more players gonna step up, man. So good to see my boy Matia come back to play the main striker, man. Cause uh, Rashford is not a striker like that. So yeah, it is what it is, man. So uh, so far, Liverpool is pretty much setting record, bro. Liverpool is the best team in England. Probably one of the best team in Europe, in my opinion. Uh, probably the best team in the world right now, in my opinion, man. So Liverpool right now. Um, eight games so far, eight wins, bro. Like a lot of these games, like they should have never win, bro, and they just win because team. I don't think teams really um play Liverpool in the Premier League. I think teams are afraid to rip Liverpool, so they eventually make mistakes instead of like play Liverpool, like play against them. They don't really play against Liverpool like that. The only team I've seen really play against Liverpool was that like that Red Bull team, that Napoli team. When it comes to Europe, bro. When it comes to Europe, teams are not afraid of any teams, man. These teams play against Liverpool. That's why they, they score goals and have good results versus Liverpool in Europe. But when it comes to Premier League, Premier League, man, England, everybody's scared of Liverpool. And that's what they have right now. They have that scare effect, they have that scare factor. Even City doesn't have the scare factor that Liverpool has, man. City, team really stand up to City. I don't think they do that versus Liverpool. They always make mistakes and allow Liverpool to win games. Uh, but yeah, man, eight wins so far for Liverpool, man. One of the... Um, top goal scoring team, the second best goal scoring team behind Manchester City, uh, with twenty game with twenty goals scored so far, eight wins, zero losses, zero uh, draws, and um, yeah, conceded six goals so far. Right now, in my opinion, they're the best uh, defensive team in the league. Um, yeah, the best defensive team in the league, bro. It's just crazy how, how good they are. And uh, yeah, man, United right now are in. Uh, where are they, man? Uh, 12 phase. I had to look on the freaking. <laughs> couldn't find them on the table. So right now they're sitting in 12th place, uh, 8 game plays so far, 2 wins, 3 draws, and uh, 3 losses, man. And uh, yeah, not even really score, man. They scored 9 goals, bro. That's the most they scored in 8 games. That's crazy. And they haven't won a game in a while, bro. So. They lost, uh, the, the last three games they played is um, one loss, one draw, and a loss, man. So, it should be, it's, it's going to be a crazy game, in my opinion. And, uh, yeah, the last time a team, um, a manager, a United manager lost to Liverpool, he got fired, man. So, I don't think it's going to happen this time, but would be surprised. If Liverpool blow, blow them out of the water, Solskjaer probably have to leave. Uh, so, the last six times these two teams play each other, man. It has been a three draws, one win for United, and two draws for Liverpool. And uh, the last game ended in a 0-0 draw in uh, uh, Febu February, right? Yeah, February 24th of 2019 ended in a draw. Before that, it was a 3-1 win for Liverpool. Jose Mourinho got fired. Uh, but yeah, United beat the last time United beat uh, Liverpool was back in 2018. Uh, so it should be a very interesting game, bro. should be a very, very interesting game. And I'm really looking forward to this game. I um, wish I could do a live stream for this, but unfortunately, I got to work. And, uh, yeah, let's get into this, man. So, a lot of injury for United, bro. I don't know, man. Bye, he's out, bro. Bye, is out. Might, might as well release Bye, because this guy doesn't play. He's always hurt. Uh, Timothy Fosso, um, Fosso, Mensa is out with an injury. Uh, Phil Jones is out with an injury. Not surprised by that. 
Diego Dalla is out with an injury. Paul Pablo is out with an injury. And David De Gea is out with an injury, man. All these injuries are long-term injuries, by the way. And they, these guys won't be back very soon. Uh, Aaron, Aaron Juan Basake is pretty much unfit for this game. He did pick up a injury before the interna uh, right at international break, man. So it should be crazy. Daniel James is doubtful. Anthony Mat Martial is doubtful, but more than likely will play. Luke Shaw is doubtful. And Jesse Lingard is awful, man. So who the hell United has to play for them, bro? Like the whole team is just going to be young guys and rookies, bro. This is going to be a trash team, man. Uh, um, but yeah, man, Nathan Klein is out for a while. Might as well release him. Uh, Jordan, uh Shakira is um, out for this game. Going to be out for a while. Um, RV Elliott is um, out because of a red card. Who the hell is that guy? Um, Allison um, is doubtful for this game. Um, probably back in the next two weeks or so. Probably back for Champions League game. Uh, Joel uh, Matip is doubtful for this game and Mohamed Salah is doubtful for this game man. but I think if Mohamed Salah is in a wheelchair it will still play man so more than likely 100% Salah will play in this game because <laughs> y'all need Salah 100% Salah is going to play in this game either he, either he fit on fit or no matter what in a wheelchair he's definitely going to play and he's definitely going to be scoring goals no matter what no matter his status really and um, yeah, for formation, um, United is going to go with a 4-2-3-1 formation and Liverpool is going to go with a 4-3-3 formation. So United, they're going to have um, Ramiro in goal, man. I think probably one of the best uh, number two out there uh, at, a, at, a, at a club. Um, Ashley Young on the left side, El Capo, uh, Maguire and uh, Lindelof as his two center back and uh, Juan Misake as the right back. I, I'm, most of these guys are pretty much doubtful and, and uh, unfit for this game, man, but I think they're going to force them in there. Um, center back, we're going with Matish and Mark Timine. Mark Timine as the two center backs. And center, central midfielders. Uh, Rashford on the left side. Martial and, as the attacking midfielder. And uh, Daniel James as on the right side. And on top, we're going to go with Martial. Man. I think Martial should be fit and ready for this game. Uh, for Liverpool, we're gonna go with a um, Allison, in, Allison or Becker in goal, man. So one of these guys, I say, I think I go with Becker. I don't think Allison gonna be fit for this game. Robertson on the left side, uh, Van Dijk and and uh, either Matip or Gomez. I know Matip is doubtful, so I, I'm gonna go with Gomez as a center center back and uh, Alex Arnold as the right back. Uh, midfield three, we're gonna go with Ronaldo, uh, Fabinho and uh, Anderson, bro. And this thing gonna get destroyed in this game. He can't keep up with the pace of Daniel James or, or those guys. So he better stay, stick on his side and don't switch over. And up top we're gonna go with Mane as the left winger, um, Firmino as the main striker, and uh, Salah, bro. I think man, no matter what the injury, is, Salah's gonna play. He's gonna score goals. He's gonna be a threat, man. So Salah on the right side, and yeah, that's it, man, for my prediction lineup for this game, man. Liverpool versus uh, United. It should be a very um, lively and entertaining event. Or it could be a 0-0 draw, man. But my prediction is a 1-1 draw for this game. I don't think Liverpool going to be able to beat United, bro. Uh, United is not the best of form, man. But Derby, once it comes to Derby, everything is out the window, man. I think uh, United is going to hold on. It's going to be very stubborn. It's going to be a 1-1 draw, man. Liverpool score, uh, United scoring first and Liverpool scoring equalizer. But like, subscribe, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Leave a comment, share this video. With that, you boys out of here. Peace.